Hello lovelies, welcome back to my channel. I remind you that we post new videos every Monday, Wednesday and Friday. So in the comments section in the last video you asked me to tell you more about puffy sleeves. So I'm here to do that for you because I love you. By the way, thank you so much for your birthday wishes. It's really mean a lot to me. Today we will be doing a modeling of the sleeve. We need the basic pattern and the sleeve itself. First we will work on the armhole and then we will work with the sleeve. Be prepared that we will need to rebuild the sleeve several times. It will take a lot of work to achieve that effect, but we are not afraid of difficulties, right? In this video you will learn how to add extra volume to the sleeve by using a dart and spread. In this video we will work with the pattern and in the next lesson we will make the layout. So we have front, back and the sleeve. We'll start with the front and back. We will have to rebuild the sleeve more than once. Be ready for that. When we work with puffy sleeves like that, be sure to be careful. The first thing to do is to remove all darts from the shoulder seams. I remove 5 cm from the shoulder and from here also 5 cm. I deepen the armhole by 1 cm. From these points where we end the deepening, we draw a straight line. We could deepen in advance, pay attention to the lines, it can be different, for example, like that. Front, shoulder. And now I will cut off. Now we have a new armhole, as you can see, where I will sew the sleeve. All attention here. We remove the front and back. We start working with the sleeve. front and back. Okay. 
As on a raglan, we cut out 7 to 8 centimeters. Here 10 to 12 millimeters. We need this piece. Back detail to back. Front piece to the front. Here's what happened. We begin to build a fluffy sleeve. Done, I throw it away, we sign immediately, front, we combine these two points, beautiful lines, we do not cut this detail, this is not the final sleeve yet. Cut something like this in the middle from the top. We will make the next cuts from these points by 3 cm. There is no need to step back by 3 cm. Here it will be 2.2 cm. There will be one fold in the middle and two folds on each side. Sleeve height 37 cm and you take as many centimeters as you like. As I told you before, 
one fold in the middle and two fold on each side. As I already told you, sleeve height 37 cm and you will take as many as you want. Eight centimeters from here to this place, eight centimeters. I will now mark the center of the sleeve with a red marker. Here I will open 5 cm. And here four centimeters. And here you should pay attention and follow me. You can do like this if you want. Line should be beautiful. What we do here, 5 cm, is just a sleeve, without puffiness.
лодочка, 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 лодочка и с лодочкой и вершина. Now I throw it all away. Three stages complete. We have built a sleeve. Here we will lay the folds. We will lay these two folds. It is impossible to show this on paper, but it will be visible on the fabric. And just with help of these folds, we will create this volume in the sleeve. The video is so long already, so I want to finish it now. See the beauty of the lines. In the next lesson I will show you how to work with tool and our puffy sleeves. I hope this video was interesting for you. This is it for today. Be different and beautiful. Subscribe to my channel, write comments, share the videos, press the like and bell buttons. As always, we would really appreciate your support. Don't forget to follow us on our Instagram platform Global Fashion Workshop. The link will be down below. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you in our next one. Bye!